welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into the Hongdu GJ-11 Sharp Sword, China's cutting-edge unmanned combat aerial vehicle that's pushing the boundaries of stealth drone technology with its flying wing design, internal weapons bays, and multi-role capabilities for reconnaissance, strikes, and electronic warfare designed to enhance the People's Liberation Army's air power in contested environments. And whether you're a military aviation enthusiast, a defense tech geek, or just fascinated by China's rapid advancements in unmanned systems, Systems, you're in for an explosive episode packed with every detail about this revolutionary drone. So buckle up and get ready for the ultimate deep dive into everything that makes the GJ-11 Sharp Sword a game changer in modern aerial warfare. Developed by Hongdu Aviation Industry Corporation, part of the Aviation Industry Corporation of China, AVIC. The GJ-11, also known as Gongji-11 or Sharp Sword, first emerged in concept form around 2010 and made its public debut at the Zhuhai Air Show in 2013 as a demonstrator, evolving into a full-scale unmanned combat aerial vehicle, unveiled in 2019 during the 70th anniversary parade of the People's Republic of China, marking a significant milestone in China's push for indigenous stealth drone technology to rival Western systems with testing accelerating by 2024, as evidenced by satellite imagery and videos of flights near secretive bases, and its development, influenced by global trends in unmanned aerial vehicles, like the US RQ-170 Sentinel, focuses on carrier compatibility for naval variants like the GJ-11J, potentially for operations from ships like the Type 003 Fujian, underscoring China's ambition to integrate stealth drones into its carrier air wings for enhanced power projection in regions like the South China Sea or Taiwan Strait. Let's break down its design. The GJ-11 Sharp Sword is a tailless flying wing unmanned combat aerial vehicle with a distinctive stealth-optimized shape measuring approximately 11 meters in length with a wingspan of 14 meters and a height of around 2.5 meters, weighing an estimated 5 tons at takeoff, powered by a single WS-13 turbofan engine delivering around 4,000 kilograms of thrust for a cruise speed of 800 to 1,000 kilometers per hour and an endurance of several hours, with a range potentially exceeding 1,500 kilometers depending on payload and mission profile. And it operates autonomously or remotely with no onboard crew, featuring a triangular fuselage for reduced radar cross-section through radar absorbent materials and serrated edges. And its standout feature is the internal weapons bay capable of carrying up to two tons of munitions, including precision-guided bombs, air-to-ground missiles like the KD-10 or KD-20, or anti-radiation missiles for suppressing enemy air defenses, with provisions for electronic warfare pods or reconnaissance sensors mounted externally if needed. And the drone's avionics include advanced fly-by-wire controls, artificial intelligence-assisted navigation, and data links for real-time communication with ground stations or manned aircraft, enabling swarm operations or loyal wingman roles alongside fighters like the J-20, while its sensor suite likely incorporates electro-optical slash infrared cameras, synthetic aperture radar, and electronic intelligence gatherers for all-weather reconnaissance and targeting. The design emphasizes low observability with a radar cross-section comparable to advanced stealth drones, allowing it to penetrate defended airspace for deep strikes, and its modular structure supports land-based or carrier takeoffs, with folding wings and naval variants for compact storage aboard ships. The GJ-11 Sharp Sword's role in the People's Liberation Army is multifaceted, serving as a stealthy penetrator for high-risk missions where manned aircraft might be vulnerable, strategically deployed to support air dominance in contested regions like the Taiwan Strait or South China Sea, where it can conduct reconnaissance deep into enemy territory, launch precision strikes on air defenses or command centers, or perform electronic countermeasures to disrupt radar and communications, and its capabilities shine across various scenarios. For intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance, its low radar signature and sensor suite enable undetected monitoring of naval fleets or ground installations. For offensive strikes, the internal bay deploys munitions like laser-guided bombs or anti-ship missiles to neutralize threats without exposing pilots to danger. And for loyal wingman duties, it pairs with fighters like the J-20 to act as a force multiplier, 
scouting ahead, drawing fire, or coordinating swarm attacks with other drones, enhancing China's integrated air operations doctrine, and the drone's autonomy allows it to operate in GPS-denied environments using inertial navigation or artificial intelligence, with potential for carrier-based launches from vessels like the Liaoning or Fujian to extend naval strike ranges beyond 1,000 kilometers, making it ideal for anti-access slash area denial strategies against adversaries. Its tailless flying wing configuration provides inherent stability and low observability, allowing it to evade radar while carrying out electronic warfare or suppression of enemy air defenses, positioning it as a key asset for breaking through integrated defense networks in potential conflicts. Operationally, the GJ-11 Sharp Sword remains in advanced testing as of 2025, with production likely limited to a small fleet of prototypes or early units for the People's Liberation Army Air Force and Navy. Having accumulated flight hours through secretive trials at bases like the China Flight Test Establishment in Yanliang, where videos captured in August 2024 showed it flying overhead, demonstrating stable flight and potential carrier compatibility, and while no combat deployments are confirmed, its development has accelerated since 2024, with satellite imagery revealing increased activity at test sites, including possible naval variants for operations from aircraft carriers, and recent demonstrations at air shows like Zhuhai in 2024 featured scale models highlighting its internal weapons bays and stealth features, sparking international interest with social media discussions on platforms like X buzzing about its resemblance to U.S. drones like the RQ-170 and its potential as a loyal wingman for stealth fighters, though unverified claims of operational status or specific payload capacities should be treated cautiously and production estimates suggest dozens in service by the late 2020s, with costs potentially lower than manned fighters at around $30 to $50 million per unit, emphasizing China's focus on cost-effective unmanned systems for mass deployment. Culturally, the GJ-11 Sharp Sword has become a symbol of China's technological prowess and self-reliance in unmanned aviation, featured prominently in state media and air shows as a testament to national innovation, inspiring pride amid U.S.-China tech rivalries with its sleek flying wing design drawing sci-fi comparisons and fueling online debates about its superiority to foreign drones. Though experts note challenges like engine thrust limitations and data link vulnerabilities in jammed environments, and its integration into the People's Liberation Army underscores a shift toward unmanned systems for high-risk missions, reducing pilot losses while expanding operational reach. Looking to the future, the GJ-11's modular architecture supports upgrades like enhanced turbofan engines for longer endurance, artificial intelligence for autonomous decision-making, or integration with hypersonic munitions for standoff strikes, ensuring relevance through the 2030s as China expands its unmanned fleet and potential naval variants could revolutionize carrier air wings, enabling persistent surveillance and strikes from sea. While export versions might be offered to allies like Pakistan, positioning the Sharp Sword as a key player in global unmanned combat aerial vehicle proliferation. So there you have it, fans. This is the ultimate deep dive into the Hongdu GJ-11 Sharp Sword, China's stealth drone powerhouse slicing through the skies. We want to hear from you. What's your favorite feature? the flying wing stealth design, the internal weapons bays, or its loyal wingman potential? Is it a true rival to Western drones or still in testing shadows? Drop your thoughts in the comments below, smash that like button if you loved this deep dive, subscribe for more epic military breakdowns, share with your fellow defense enthusiasts, and hit that bell icon so you never miss an upload, because we've got more high-flying content coming your way. So stay tuned and we'll see you in the next one.